guys, welcome back to Adrana and Mine's Skyrim Adventure. I've tried to do a little bit to fix the lag. I have literally not left this spot since the last video. So we'll just see if what I've done with the recording software has fixed the lag at all. So we're going to start off. We better actually figure out. I, I get this feeling we're in the reach right now because I'm pretty sure we're a force. I'm a... Wait a minute. Huh. Well, I'm apparently just a hunter. Right next to Helgen. Well, good. We pl I planned on starting the um, main quest line anyway. So, let's go. We gotta go to the... Um, we have to go to Helgen now. Um, yeah, because, you know, I've been playing through Skyrim a couple times recently. And I've noticed, since usually this is the last thing I do because the whole point of me having that mod on that randomly starts my game is I, just to let me do what I want. Well, I don't get why this game is lagging so badly right now. I think I'm going to turn down the grass a bit. Settings, display, yeah, grass is, well, grass is just ridiculous. Alright, so maybe this will help out a little bit. With a lag. Right, maybe. Who knows, we'll see. It feels like it is a little bit. So, let's get going up here. I think this is Helgen. If it's not Helgen, I'd be surprised. I like how we're charging into battle with an at like a woodcutter's axe. This seems like it's a really smart idea. I gotta go find... I think... I've decided that she's gonna join the Stormcloaks. Because I just really hate the Thalmor. On my last playthrough, where I left off on it was I was... Basically... Talking to Ancano. And I really hate Ancano. He's a terrible person and needs to just disappear. Alright, well we got almost halfway into Helgen before it said we discovered it. This person is pretty crispy, so let's take their body. Oh, and there's a journal. Let's read up that journal. So, you know, it, this recording software I'm using is just so stupid. It's being, it's just lagging the heck out of this game right now. All right, let's read this then. Twelfth of last seed. Hard to believe I filled up the whole journal already. I never realized how much of Cyrodiil. I hadn't seen yet. So much diversity, yet so much destruction from the Great War. A lot of history was has been lost forever. Ex expedition and everyone will be... Can't read... Alright, well you know what? We're not going to read that then because the game does not seem to want us to read it. Alright, well we got a new quest marker, so let's go follow where the quest marker is. Uh, it's not through there. See, it gives me the option to go warn the residents of Riverwood about this. And it, no matter what, it still makes me come back here and go search for survivors. So, I guess we're going to go down here. This is interesting, yeah, because I've never had it where I've just, I was. I was just camping in the woods around Helgen. And I guess this fits into the lore, since I wasn't actually at Helgen when the dragon attacked. Um, it... But I was, like, right next to it, so that means I saw it still. So, we're almost to the cave. Uh, I think... Alright, here we are. La Cave de Helgen. Oh, shit. Looks like people are getting attacked by spiders. We better save them. What the heck? What the heck just happened? I don't think this was supposed to be happening. I'm gonna join the Stormcloaks and you're an Imperial. This was a mistake. This was a mistake. This is a mistake. Oh my god, this was a mistake. I shouldn't have attacked him. 
Oh my god, they're shooting at me. Oh, I gotta get out of the cave. Uh. Uh. Items, better heal real quick. This is not going well so far. I'll just eat these apples. That didn't help. One healing potion. Oh my god, I gotta escape. Escape from that cave. I like how when we went in there was just a smoky loading screen. And on the way out now we've got a dick of an elf standing here. Yeah, so definitely not going to attack him next time we go in that cave. That was not the smartest move I could have made. So we'll just let the nature take its course and attack him. But we gotta go save uh, Rayloff, the Stormcloak guy that's in that cave. So if we can't save him, then what's the point? I mean, seriously. Alright, here we are. Back into the cave. Hopefully, Hadvar is not a terrible person anymore. And we got more smoky loading screens. I think he'll be fine now because the dramatic music just stopped. I don't know though, we'll have to see what happens. Alright, well here we are, back in the cave, so we're not going to kill anybody this time. We are just going to let nature take its course, and if they want to die themselves, we'll let them die. Oh, uh-oh. Why is there only one? Uh-oh, he's mad. He's angry! Let's go, Rayloff. Come on, get up, buddy. We gotta go. Get up. Let's go, come on. I brought you a healing potion, pal. What? Why does it... I have one right here. There you are, Rayla. Have a healing potion. Oh no. Why are they attacking me? Dear Lord. Well, at least Hadvar's dead. You gotta escape. My God. Uh oh. Shit, I'm trapped. Better keep running. Uh oh. Where the hell is the exit? I swear to god, it was like... Oh, sorry. We gotta escape before Hadbar kills me. Alright. Thanks for sparing me, Hadvar. You're a boss, man. Alright. This will be something fun to do. Do hearth fire. I don't know. We'll have to get there, though. If we can find... I think... We've got some pretty good house mods installed on here, so. We'll see where it takes us. Whoa, what's going on with this stupid table? I, like, looked away from the screen for a minute and looked back, and it was, like, off screen almost altogether. And there we go. No more. Uh oh. No more table on the screen. Oh, it's back. Nope, it's gone. Alright, we're out of the cave. Alright.
right, Hadvar. Are you good, bro? Hadvar? Right, no, Raylock. Right gone for good this time. My sister, Gerder, runs the mill in Riverwood. Like, Gerder, as in, like, the things they make buildings out of? She'd help you out. Alright, well, we'll go see Gerder. Wait, isn't that a Pokemon? Let's... Let it's probably best if we split up. Alright, bro, I'll see you when I we join the Stormcloak Rebellion. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. All right, we need to get some weapons, cause this stupid axe is not gonna satisfy me. Why is there just a camp down? Here? Yes, you've said that before, Rayloff. Whose camp is this? All right, this can't be right. This is the magical floating camp of fate that I've heard about. The invisible spirits of fate live there. And we better stay away from there because they are no they have been known to just get up in all up in people's business. And we really do not want them in our business. So we're gonna keep running here. Gonna be park parquet across some rocks, you know. And yes I know it's not really parquet. I just like saying parquet. And alrighty, we're almost there. I don't want to be heading that direction. I don't want to head towards the Standing Stones. We want to head towards Riverwood. Uh, I do not get the point of all this lag. I'm not exactly sure what's happening with it, but who knows. Hopefully this lag will disappear after a while. It might just be because of how... F I think it might be the Summer Skyrim mod that I have on. I really hope it's not, because I really like Summer Skyrim. But, who knows. I've turned off pretty much every city overhaul mod that I had on, except for White Runs. Because, uh-oh, uh-oh, we have a wolf! Time to do what hunters do best. Which is not pull out their axe when I click the button. No wolves? Yeah, you little wolves. You better stay away from me. I am the- oh, oh no, they're back! Why are you, are you... Why are you running from me? I'm level one. Or are you just more interested in everything else? Okay, good. You're smart, wolf. I found a wolf in my last playthrough down in the... Um, the midden underneath Winterhold College. And it just literally was just standing there howling. It didn't attack me. It didn't move. It just stood there. So, we gotta be careful of those non-aggressive wolves. Because they might just snap at any moment all right well here we are the beautiful town of Riverwood you know I've been looking oh Korea my friend haven't seen you in years how's the business let's see here looks like that's it got to go ah good times that's all you ever say to me all right. Well, we're here in Riverwood. Hey, you—you're not supposed to be here. Who the heck are you, Alan? Hi, Alan. I might take your carriage to White Run soon. My dragon. I saw a dragon. What? You saw a dragon? Truly. Maybe my mother isn't crazy after all. Sven, you're a horrible you're person for thinking your mom's crazy. Oh, thank you, your idiotness. Right. Wait, I talked to and Sven, not Gerder. Whatever, I guess that doesn't matter who you talk to. Alright, talk to the Jarl of White Run. I can handle it. Alright, mi amigo. Alan, let's ride. Oh, there goes Hed. There goes my buddy, Rayloff. I'd like to hire your carriage, sir. Where do you want to go? I want to go to. Not going to Markarth. I want to go to White Run. It's the runniest white place in America. All right, hopping in the back of your crappy truck. Will this be considered a truck? Never been to White Run before? Woo! The last time I did one of these playthroughs, it would not let me um, ride on these carriages. It just kept, um, I'd get in the back and it wouldn't take the money out and wouldn't take me anywhere. 
see, this is like something they should have done in like all of Skyrim. Like every city needs to have a carriage at it. I mean, for people like I know I've done several let not let's plays, but um, playthroughs where I haven't used fast travel, and that really helped out. I mean, yeah, it's kind of cheating, but not really at the same time, because you can't fast travel to any far locations. It all has to be main cities and small towns. And if you think about it, half the time, like, you're taking these carriages, they're probably passing through small towns anyway. So why not? You're probably going to be stuck on this stupid loading screen here, though I hope it gets... Unstuck. Oh, sorry guys, I've just been like yawning pretty much for this entire video. So, we're still loading. Like I said, this is something I've been having a problem with. Sometimes loading screens get stuck infinitely. It's usually when I'm traveling, fast traveling, but we'll see what's going on. And usually they're not this type of loading screen when I'm fast traveling either, but... I don't know what's going to happen with this. If it gets frozen, I guess we'll probably have to end the video. I'm just give it another couple seconds. Once the music changes up, oh, there it goes. We're in White Run. Hooray, hooray. All right. Oh, let's see here. I wonder how much a horse costs. Why? Why lag you? Wait, there's a person sleeping over there in that pile of hay. And she's naked, I'm lovely. All ears. What? Where am I? Who are you? Oh, it's you. Um, who do you, how do you know me? No, I've never seen you before. I have no idea who you are. Are you yeah, sure you don't know who I am? You've been stalking me, haven't you? Why well, you don't give me more options to talk to you? Wait! Don't leave! I I'm injured! Uh, yeah, you yes, look injured. injured. You I mean, you're naked. Me you. Otherwise, I might die, and you wouldn't want that on your conscience. Meh. Probably shouldn't let her die. Yeah, well, that's because... Okay, fine. If you take me with you, I will make it worth your while. Millionaire! I wonder what she could do you for won't me. You find anyone tougher than me in Skyrim. Not to mention that's good looking. Alright. Alright then, you can come aboard. Ah, uh, you are so funny. I'm just... Can you name someone better than me? I didn't think so. Uh, you're the first anyway, person I've met besides, um, old Rayloff. Uh, are you alright? Of course I'm alright. Don't start fuzzing over me. I'm more than capable of handling what myself. What happened to your clothes? What? Oh, I have no idea. My memory is a little fuzzy. If yeah, you have to probably, any, you filthy it. drunk. Oh, and stop staring at my body. It's like you've never seen a semi-naked woman before. Oh, I, I, sh um, Idrana is a woman, so. I don't know. I'll just go wherever you are going. Oh, good, we're going to see the Jarl. By fighting alongside you. Surely that's an offer you can't refuse. I don't. I thought I would help you out. Oh, well, it's nice for you to help me out. I've got an axe. You've got a steel sword. Well, I was hoping you would kind of keep me company. Look, I know it sounds weird, but... I don't like talking. This is own. taking for too long here. Come you on, can Sophie. You can tell me to leave if you want, but surely you can at least give me a chance. Let's go, Sophie. I'm not allowed out on my own now. I had a little too much to drink. Is this Sophie from so Windhelm grown up? I guess I must have passed out. I hope I didn't cause too much trouble. That'd be ridiculous if that's Actually, who it was. I'm not really that bothered. Okay, then. What just happened there? Why was I just walking oh, away? I haven't introduced myself, have I? My name is Sophia. 
but you probably already knew You're that. You're, like, ridiculously it's talking, quite baby. quite well known in Skyrim, although sometimes I'm not sure if it's for the right reasons. Alright. I unfortunately I cannot skip your dialogue. Adventure. Although it's no fun without anyone to witness my heroic deeds, such as... Such as who? I'm sure that's probably something. I like to get drunk, kill stuff, and be a nuisance. So, what about you? Alright, let's see what I have to say. Alright, I'm a fellow you. adventurer. I hope to be of some use to you. I'm ready. Just let me know. Alright, Idrana. You've got yourself a friend. Who has a horse, apparently. Let's get into Whiterun. Because this lag storm is killing me. Maybe this is what's causing the lag. Who knows? It's like once I get running, the lag kind of goes. Like if, as soon as I start to turn any other direction than the so one I'm off facing. The of White Run, then? They wouldn't let me into Dragon's Reach. Apparently, I wasn't important enough. But with you, I might get away with it. Why? Why, why am I important? I saw a dragon burn down Helgen. Distracting the guards. Uh oh. Like I just saw those chains like jangling over there. It's like ridiculous. Also, I have a mod on called Moro Loot. So, whoa! What are you talking about? Riverwood calls for the Jarl's Age. You better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach at the top of the hill. Good. Luck to you, guard. I like how I needed a key to open that, and then I just ran up to it and opened it by myself no matter what. That's that, that's totally legit, you know? Because this game is just full of legitimacies. Loading screen, loading screen, how I hate you so. Loading, loading, loading screen, loading screen, yo. Seriously, these loading screens take too dang long. I think this is probably, once this loading screen stops, where we're going to end it. I don't know, because this has been a pretty long video so far. Because I, um, I mean, we've gone pretty far, actually. We went from Helgen to Riverwood to Whiterun, had a conversation with Sophia for too long and now we're going into Whiterun so I think that's a good enough length of video so here we are Whiterun I think I have a mod on called um uh what, what's it called uh Supreme Storms I'm gonna turn that off see if that fixes the lag problem so thanks for watching guys if you like the video comment and subscribe so thanks for watching bye